about the social st stratification. So what do you mean by social stratification? Let us see the meaning, definitions, characteristics, functions of social stratification. First, the meaning. In all societies, people differ from each other on the basis of their age, sex and personal characteristics. Human society is not a homogeneous but heterogeneous. Apart from the natural differences, human beings are also differentiated according to socially approved criteria. So socially differentiated, men are treated as socially unequal from the point of view of enjoyment of social rewards like status, power, income, etc. That may be called social inequality. The term social inequality simply refers to the existence of socially created inequalities. Then social stratification is a particular form of social inequality. All society arrange their members in terms of superiority, inferiority and equality. Stratification is a process of interaction or differentiation whereby some people come to rank higher than others. Definitions this is given by Ogman and Ninkoff. According to them, the process by which individuals and groups are ranked in more or less enduring hierarchy of status is known as stratification. According to this part, social stratification is the division of social society into permanent groups of categories linked with each other by the relationship of superiority and subordination. According to Williams, social stratification is defined as the rank, ranking of individuals on a scale of superiority, inferiority, equality, according to some commonly accepted basis of values. According to Raymond Murray, social stratification is horizontal division of society into higher and lower social units. Next, you can see the characteristics of stratification. It is social. Why it is called as a social? Stratification is social in the sense that it does not represent inequality which are biologically based. It is true that factors such as strength, intelligence, age, sex can also serve as the basis on which status are distinguished. But some differences by themselves are not sufficient to explain why some statuses receive more power, poverty, and prestige than others. It is ancient. The stratification system is very old. Stratification was present even in the small wandering bands. Age, sex were the main criteria of stratification. Difference between the rich and poor, powerful and humble, freedom and slaves was there in almost all the ancient civilization. Even since the time of Plato, social philosophers have been deeply concerned with the economic, social, political inequalities. It is universal. The third one is it is universal. Social stratification is universal in nature. Difference between rich and poor. The haves or have nots is evident everywhere. Even in the non-literal societies, stratification is very much present. It is in diverse forms. Social stratification has never been uniform, uniform in all societies. The ancient Roman society was stratified into two strata, the patricians and the plebeians. The Orient society was divided into four varnas, the Brahmins, Satriyas, Vaishyas and the Sutras. The ancient Greek society into freedom and slaves. The ancient Chinese society into mandarins, merchants, former and soldiers. Class and estates seems to be the general forms of stratification found in the modern society. It is consequential. The stratification system has its own consequences. The most important, most desired and often the, the scarcest things in human life are distributed unequally because of stratification. The system leads to two kinds of consequences, life chances and lifestyle. Functions of social stratification. First one, competition. Individuals based on their attributes compete with each other and only those individuals who have better attributes get greater recognition. This may be in the field of sports, education, occupation, etc. 
Next one, recognition of talent. The persons with more training skills, experiences and education are given better positions. The deserving individuals are not treated at, at par with the deserving candidates, such as systems helps people to acquire better talent. So this kind of uh, advantages are there. So their students try to avoid the stratified attitude in our society in future.